day three arrived, we headed downtown to Market Street to check out the Chattanooga Choo Choo. I knew where we were going because you said to me, all aboard! The Chattanooga Choo Choo, more than a hotel now. Nice. I bet it's cool staying here in this. Yeah, it's different, I know that. Oh, look at the Art Deco. Wow, look at that. Oh, my God, look all the way up. Oh, look, the trains from Atlanta, Cincinnati, and Memphis all came here. And we've been to the one in Cincinnati. Yes, we have. It's crazy to think it's been here since 1909. All right, let's go check out the choo-choo outside. Oh, yeah. Is that the original choo-choo? Looks like it. Wow. Read something here about it. It was on March 5th, 1880, that the first passenger train leaving Cincinnati for Chattanooga was nicknamed the Chattanooga Choo Choo. How'd you like to stay in one of these? Back in the day, yes. Today, no. I like oh, come my on. I like my RV. Wow, look at this old beast. Wow, look at this. Could you imagine the guys that had to shovel the coal? Man, it must have been so hot in here. Oh. You ready to ring the bell? Let's do it. All aboard! Good wow, loud. that thing is loud. Man, you could hear that all over the town. On our first date, we realized that we both wanted to be rock stars. So while we're in Chattanooga, I figured I'd bring him to the Songbirds Museum. You would plan a day like that. I heard this place has a kids program where every kid gets a guitar and music lessons so they can become a rock star themselves. It's a guitar and pop culture museum. Are you ready to rock and roll? Yeah. <sighs> wow. Look at this place. We got to the Songbirds Museum, we walked in and met Reed. Reed took us all through the museum. It was really an interactive experience. Oh, there hey. he is. How are y'all? Welcome to Songbirds. Thank you. Nice to meet you, Reed. Nice to meet y'all. Let's check it out. I'm looking forward to it. All right. Let's get a tour. This side of the museum is the steam section of the museum. It's talking about the science of sound, how the guitar works, basically what the problem was that created the guitar and how they rectified that problem. And the problem was feedback, was the main issue that we had when coming up with the electric guitar. They made all the exhibits for kids. You can punch all the buttons, of course, that's what I was doing. The infinite loop of what creates feedback. My nephews would love this one. I like how they broke the sound down in science. You know, how the waves of sound move, the amplifiers, the pedals, how they invented things. It was awesome. Everything we do here is to support our Guitars for Kids program, and it's a big program. We've grown over the last five years to encompass three states. We give out about a thousand free guitars to kids every year. We see every year arts and music programs getting cut in our schools for different reasons, and we created this program to combat that. We need places like this. We need inspiration and motivation for our kids, and music is such a gift. Cadillac green, that's gorgeous. All oh, these are just absolutely beautiful. Dude, do you hear that? I think Someone, I hear music. Somebody's playing live music. They gotta find it. It's a really historic city, but what we're finding out is that there's lots of little new things, and the new community coming in is very creative. I will be back for sure when I come to Chattanooga. I want to definitely check out some music here.